Okay, here we have the new the new Tenassi Wong. It's going to demonstrate some of the stuff. This is Rob's personal bike now. It's going to show you some of the uh, add-ons that he has done and some of the stock stuff. Obviously, as we can see, the swing arm is a piece of work. It is beautiful all on its own. Rob has put on the CSP. Um, uh, uh, chain tensioners. He's also put on, uh, this is an Apico off of a gas gas. Uh, the brake pads have been upgraded um, to, uh, uh, which brake pads? Galfer. To the Gelfer brake pads on it. Um, Rob has made a modification with uh, um, a little different flap here, mud flap. He's done some modifications in the suspension to make it for his lightweight body that he is. And of course, you know, like there, here's the extra five horsepower stickers. So he's got three of them, a 15 horsepower extra. Oh, maybe four, liquid molly. Um, so you'll notice as well, the uh, foot peg, billet aluminum, CSP tip that he's managed to fit on there. You'll notice the brake pedal is actually adjustable. Um, so you've got your different adjustments on it where you can put it to wherever your foot size is gonna fit. It's managed to fit uh, a set of uh, frame guards on here as well, plastic frame guards. Uh, a Pico titanium foot pegs. Uh, Pico, I'm going to turn up this way just because I know you guys are going to hate me. A Pico fork leg uh, protection. Um, he's been modifying and figured out a nice little frame uh, uh, rad protector here. We have removed the stock headlight. Who rides a trials bike at night? Um, he's gone with the Enduro Engineering. Um, but, uh, bark buster style here just simply because we find that the trees hit these it's a nice open style the jitsi levers that fit right in on the uh, agp calipers the csp covers again all that's all extras uh the, the i think those are csp adjusters there as well jitsi bar pad he's going with the pico bars all this is all just stock off our shelf that fits onto these bikes you notice this is factory, it's actual real carbon fiber. This is factory, real carbon fiber. Uh, this is factory, real carbon fiber. Rob has done a carbon fiber heat shield here to help him out a little bit. Um, guys were finding the Apico, or the stock shifter sat down pretty low, so they were kind of thinking it was maybe a little in the area where it might get hit, so they've changed to a beta Apico shifter that fits. And just because um, I'm here, oh yes, the chain. The chain is something, another piece of art. Look at the chain itself too. The chain uh, is hollow uh, in the links, drilled links. And look at the other side of the swing arm. And I'm just gonna fire this up for you just because I know that there's the other video with the sound. But look at that, electric, fuel injected, and Oh, was that ever hard to start? Oh, I'm tired kicking this one over. So there is the new Tenassi Wong 2018 liquid cooled 200 cc fuel injected purring away at 82 decibels. And that would be probably somewhere around the, the 90 mark, I would imagine. But again, we are inside. Everything's closed up. It's too cold outside to run this outside. Well, there you go, gentlemen, out on the West Coast. I hope you enjoy your nice weather you're having out there. And I hope you enjoyed this display of this fancy Tenassi Wong brought to you by Langs Off Road and Mr. Craig. See ya.